Hey, what's up, YouTube? Why don't you go ahead and click that subscribe button right now? Hey, what's up? Trying to stay alive in a crazy world. Same here. Okay, someone gifted me a coffee maker that I tried using and it just like jammed up right away. And I was wondering if you sold parts for it. That looks like a percolator. Okay. And I don't have that. Because what I did was like put the coffee in here and then poured water in. Yeah. And then it was immediately like clogged. But you don't sell this one? I don't, and I've never seen one in person. So, did coffee get... Okay, so, can I see it? Yeah. Because this is super strange. I have an AeroPress and like a mocha pot, but I've never seen one of those. Because it doesn't look like it had any filter here. Yeah. Right? No. Can I take this off? Yeah, go for it. Okay, yeah, that wasn't going to work, right? <laughs> is the coffee supposed to go in I here? I don't totally know. You put the coffee in here? Yeah. Because it just looked like an AeroPress, and I just kind of... Yeah, that's kind of what I... <laughs> they didn't give you any instructions? No, it was, in a, it was like a gift bag. I wish I knew more, man. <laughs> I've never seen such a contraption before. And that lens is filthy. Let's get that cleaned off real quick. All right, it's Tuesday afternoon. I have stopped by the two Pit Viper storage units. I don't know what's in there, but I bet there's going to be some funny shit. Here's the part I thought would be cool. <laughs> Alrighty, welcome to Pit Viper storage unit number 511. Right off the bat, I'm seeing a pair of sunglasses here. I'll take those. Underneath this keyboard, I found a bunch of these. Somebody's to-do list from May 5th, 2019. Mom and dad, call. Subaru tires, switch. Wednesday? Dick pic image detection software. Whoa, what is this? Looks like where you store diamonds or something. That's pretty cool. Ooh, dusty old box. Oh, of course. It's one of those things. Everybody needs one of those things. All right, this is what I'm after. We've got a box of a bunch of something. Special protective eyewear, cylindrical system, class one regular. Lot 97, May 1999. It's the original Pit Viper. This is where it all began, everybody. These are military grade eyewear. I don't know if these are worth something and I wasn't supposed to open that, so I hope I don't get in trouble. Ooh, and just a moment here to notice the stacking. We have a very heavy box on top of a very heavy box on top of a, what I assume to be a pretty heavy box that's less stable. And then that's all on top of a stool down here. So you can see it's making a very dangerous work environment. OSHA not happy about that one. Found a pretty sick hatchet. Why? Would a sunglasses company have a hatchet and a storage unit? It's not a question for me to answer. Go DM Pit Viper on Instagram if you want to answer to that. Jake knows all the answers. All right, I've pulled up a chair here because I found a box labeled samples and concepts. It's a bunch of these. We've got a denim pair right here. More furry glasses. Oh, and we have got another furry pair. I think a lot of these are just goofy glasses that are used for inspiration. These are fucking sick. Which way did you go? Looks like maybe some very early pairs of 2000s, like samples from the factory before the labels. A part of Pit Viper history. The company started when Chuck Mumford began buying these shades from an army surplus store and was just splatter painting the frames on his own. I'm not totally sure, but these appear to be some of the original Chuck Mumford splatter painted ones. Magnavox introduces the new video writer word processor. Jesus Christ, it's a fucking keyboard. Sales order, handwritten, January 25th, 1989. Sold to Betsy Marsh. Change many other type styles whenever you want, when you're proud of it, print it. This thing is fucking sick. Why does Pit Viper have this? Along with this thing, there are some scary old children's toys back there and some croquet mallets. All right, so we're gonna check in next door and see what we can find. Storage unit number two, baby. Oh, yeah. 
Let's see if this thing's got any battery to it. Not looking good. That would have been really fun. All right, we're gonna do something a little different this time. We're gonna do an initial impression. I'm just gonna take a look through there. I drew that like three or four years ago. But I drew this on this whiteboard in the old office, October 2018, long before I worked here. Glad to see that it's still on the whiteboard. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's good. And a box of trash. Oh my God, if there's film in here, this will totally redeem the failure of that stupid scooter. Someone's shoe with a sock and another sock inside of that sock. That's why I got a job at Pit Viper so I could get that on film. The Barbie Power Wheels Polarized. And I found some little pouches with what appear to be lens samples in them. This one is the Tijuana Polarized. You know, it is almost 4 p.m., meaning I've put in plenty of work today. But for the sake of YouTube, I'm willing to work just a little bit more. I found a large tub of what appears to be malt extract. I don't actually know what it is, but it's some sort of viscous, oily, sticky liquid. Back here in Pit Viper storage unit, 115. This is a good thing for a sunglasses company to keep around in their storage unit. A cassette system. Guys, I'm so sorry for the sake of my job. I just gotta film some of this. <laughs> God damn it, Trevor. <clears throat> this video is called My Coworkers and I Ski Up the Mountain. There's four of us in total, and we are skiing up the mountain. Say hi, guys. It's gonna be like that Everest guy. <laughs> What's the trademark tonight? What are we trademarking? Uh, my coworker Jake Kurlander gave me a beer at the top. I'm wondering if I can return a coffee maker, like an AeroPress type thing. Yeah, it didn't work. We don't carry that I have the packaging and the receipt. Well, we don't carry that. Oh, you don't? Can I do a return here? Yeah. I tried making coffee with it, and it just got like clogged up. This isn't the right color. Oh, whoops. 